Shuttlewood. Along with this letter to you comes a play, the first I have written. And I wondered if you would read it through and send it back to me, because no matter what sort of theatrical atrocity it might be, it isn't valueless as far as I'm concerned. A fortnight ago, I didn't know the theatre existed. But a young man, anxious to improve my mind, took me along to the Opera House in Manchester. And I came away after the performance, having suddenly realised that at last, after 19 years of life, I had discovered something that means more to me than myself. I sat down and reaching home and thought. The following day I bought a packet of paper and borrowed an unbelievable typewriter which I still have great difficulty in using. I set to and produced this little epic. Don't ask me why. I'm quite unqualified for anything like this. But at least I finished the play and if from among the markings out the typing errors and the spelling mistakes you can gather a little sense from what I have written or a little nonsense I should be extremely grateful for your criticism though I hate criticism of any kind I want to write for the theatre but I know so very little about it I know nothing I have nothing except a willingness to learn and intelligence at the moment I seem to be caught between a sort of dissatisfaction in both myself and everything I'm doing and an enraptured frustration at the thought of what I'm going to do. Please can you help me? I don't really know who you are or, or what you do. I just caught sight of your name in the West Ham Magistrates Court proceedings. But please help me, if you think I'm worth helping. I'm willing enough to help myself. Yours sincerely, Sheila Delaney. It should be Dame actually, might change it.